back with another Minecraft Snapshot review, and this is um, Snapshot 13W03A. This snapshot isn't the best, it's a pretty small snapshot, not too much in it. Um, but first thing you're going to notice, um, there's no texture packs folder here anymore in the main menu. I'll get into that uh, as soon as we enter the 1.5 world there, but yeah, texture pro packs folder is no longer in the main menu. So let's load up the world. Okay, so if you go to the menu and options, you will see that there's a texture pack setting. And now you can only change your texture packs in game, but you can now change it in game, which is pretty cool, but I think they should add it back into the main menu. Uh, apparently there's some new, yeah, there's some new multiplayer settings with, oh, that's cool. I haven't checked these out yet. So, yeah, I don't really know what they do. But yeah. Um, I think that's about that for like the menu stuff. But, so, here, I've changed this up a little bit. And also, I forgot to show you the, um, crafting recipe for the activator rail. It was originally without the things in the middle, in the very first snapshot I showed you. But they changed it now, because it was a mistake for just having the iron ingots. So they changed it now to its proper crafting recipe, which is six iron ingots, two sticks, and a redstone torch in the middle. What? Oh, wait, oh, this is a trap chest, isn't it? Yeah, this is a trap chest. Haha. <laughs> Fail. Okay. So one thing I would like to show with the TNT minecart is I can activate it with the chest. Oh no. Get going. Get going, TNT minecart. There you go. Yeah, now if it's um oh just blew up the chest and a whole bunch of this. Um but so the thing I would like, one thing I would like to show, uh, here, um, be that now if it runs over an activator rail, it will not destroy the rails. No, yeah, it won't destroy any rails anymore or the blocks underneath them. And also if it's activated by an activator rail, it will not explode until it's proper time. Mm -hmm. So, uh, let me put this chest back in here. Okay, so it's the 64 diamonds in. This is for the demonstration of the new uh, minecart that is called the minecart with hopper. Pretty boring name, I know, but basically you craft it with minecart and a hopper. Sort of obvious, but put it in here. Okay, that's weird. The trap chest mount sounds might be must be a little glitched. As you'll see, it took a diamond out because it is minecart and hopper. But that's pretty cool. So basically, it works similar to a hopper. Get out of here, skeleton! There are a couple, also a couple of changes of skeletons. Ooh, killed him one hit with my fist. Um, but there are a couple of changes of skeletons. I'm just going to show you this again. I didn't want to throw you. That's not nice. I think trap chest sounds are glitched right now. Yeah, so, took out another diamond. So that's basically what it is, it's pretty cool. I think it can connect up with other hoppers as well. But yeah, that's pretty cool. And one thing quickly with these is that you can now put uh, pillar quartz blocks sideways instead of also like that. Sort of, basically how you can put wood. Um, I'm gonna go quickly into uh, some stuff with, uh, skeletons and zombies. Skeletons, they, um, shoot from farther away. I forgot to mention this in the previous snapshot. They shoot from 15 blocks away instead of 10 now. And also their, um, their accuracy is based on the difficulty it is on. So on hard, they're pretty accurate. On easy, they're, they have very sucky accuracy. I'm just flying around punching cows. Um... And so, also they will now shoot from one block away, apparently, I guess, before they did not. I'm going to fix this up. And also, 
Uh, I forget now. Ah, uh, there's something else. Uh, it's something cool with zombies now. Oh, right. Um, it'll... What? Another skeleton? There was three skeletons here before. Is there a skeleton dungeon below here or something? I'm barely hearing any skeletons, though. Why are you taking so long to kill? I had critical hits. Oh, I didn't mean to click spawn skeleton. I don't want to. I want to get back to my snapshot, you stupid thing. And I just destroyed one more stone block. Okay. I got sidetracked. Okay, it's zombie time. This is pretty cool. Let me just change myself to survival. So if if the zombie is in the daytime and it is burning, and it hits you. You're on fire too. I think that's a pretty neat addition. Don't you? Okay, enough of you. I've I'm, I've had enough of you. Growling, Brad boy, go to your room. Oh no, it's rotten flesh. Destroy it. Okay. Sorry for all that laughing in the background. It's quite annoying. Um. Also, there's a new command. Um. I forget what it is. It's not very useful. I think it's only, it can only be used, I'm pretty sure, with um, command blocks. Test 4. Uh, so I, I think it's just supposed to tell you what, like, if a player is online. Not very useful, but actually let me just... Uh, let me just test that. Give, me, give myself command block. Uh, yeah. I don't know. I'm gonna test for Doctor Who Boy. It's. Uh, test for a player. And if I do this. It says, slash test 4 is only usable by command blocks with analog output. I don't even know what analog output is, so, you know what, um, just screw that. I don't even know what it means. So, um, excuse me for everyone running around in here. Go away, please. So, um, sorry, I lost my train of thought there. There's a new, new block, yes. New block. I'm picking up experience for no reason. Okay. So there are these droppers. Honestly, there's not much point to them. They're crafted just the same way as the dispenser, except with a hopper in the middle. And, yeah, there's not much point to them. If I just destroy this. Uh, see, this one is filled with arrows. If you activate it, instead of actually shooting at the arrow, it'll just give you the arrow. And also, they can put stuff into chests, but... So there's nothing in this chest. It puts it in the chest. But yeah, not much use for the uh, droppers. Really, not much use at all, in my opinion. And, um, yeah, this review has been running a little long. With, well, not a little long, actually, just it's had a lot of pointlessness in it. I don't know. I, I don't even know. Okay. So, uh, guys, as I said, this review, or the snapshot, <laughs> the snapshot hasn't really added in, uh, anything too special, but still, so far, for 1.5, they've added in a lot of stuff, so I'm quite excited for it. Anyway, guys, Rogue Man 4, over and out, see you guys later.